Far Southern Arizona is this amazing wildlife corridor where animals that I grew up with from North America collide with wildlife from Mexico and Central America. And it starts about 30 miles south of Tucson and continues south. There is the jaguar in the Santa Rita Mountains just south of Tucson. And animals that I've seen, such as the cotamunde and the ringtail. There's even this bird, hold on, a bird, I know you say, but it, it's, it's large and it has these parrot-like colors and people come from all over the world to try to see it. It's called the elegant trogon. I spent over a decade trying to find this bird. And finally, uh, I started taking my daughter because the animals, especially the deer, were just not afraid of her. I feel like I was just like close with the animals. Like I had a connection with animals, and especially since they were wild deer. At the time, I was like, why not give it a try? I found, I tried to find some food, but they weren't into the food, but they did. It was kind of cool having that experience, just having them just like wild deer come close to something that they would be afraid of, like a person. So it was, it was a really nice feeling. We had come to the conclusion that we may never find the elegant trogon, but it was a beautiful place to be. And so we called it our day hike with our bird camera, our zoom lens, just in case we happen to stumble upon it. I love the sycamores in Madera Canyon, the water that gurgles through there, the alligator oak, the rocks, they're just beautiful. We were taking in all the nature one day and we heard it. I didn't really think that we were going to find it because it had been so long and uh, when I first heard it I didn't really know what it was to, at first until um, he said that's a trogon and I was like you mean that in that one bird that we haven't found and apparently it was a trogon for I don't know it was just it was a it was a cool feeling to find that to find the bird that we had been looking for for 10 years. It had just been a, it was just a cool feeling to finally find it. So we filmed it and luckily it didn't fly away. And it was just neat to see something so foreign and exotic looking here in my state of Arizona. We found the female, the, the partner about 200 yards away. They're so rare to see because they're only in Arizona for about six months out of the year and then they fly south. We soaked our feet in the water, told the story over and over. It was just a great day. The Elegant Trogon.